Hello friends, now we will discuss about multi-tenancy in cloud computing environment. This characteristic uh, has not been given by NIST but it is very important. So what is, uh, what is multi-tenancy? Before that we will discuss what is tenant. Let me write it here. Tenant. So it is kind of an application environment that requires some kind of isolation from the outside world or from the other tenants. So you may have visited many big buildings or offices and you may have noticed that there are many rooms. So tenant can be a department, it can be a room or it can be an organization as well. And when one particular department requires some isolation from others, so you can call it tenant okay but in cloud environment let's say that you've hosted your application or your application is uh, is using the resources uh, which is being provided by cloud environment cloud cloud provider so obviously that needs some kind of isolation so uh, the definition of multi tenancy is that a capacity of an uh, it resource to provide multi tenant environment under the acceptable isolation technique okay means your environment should be able to handle multiple tenants so uh, let's discuss one more thing let's discuss uh, in multi instance instance let me write it here multi instance because we use softwares in the form of instances or database in instances so if you have a Oracle database, obviously you would want multiple users to use that. I mean multiple uh, clients or multiple customers to use that. So you can create multiple instances of that uh, database or Oracle database. So in one instance, in one, this is the one first instance, this is second, this is third. If you are able to support multiple tenants in this particular instance like five tenants okay so if you're able to support multiple tenants in one instance instance is basically an IT resource or it can be a software it can be application that would mean that your environment is multi-tenanted so what is the good point and what is the bad point good thing is that if you need any kind of upgrade here or any break fix that would be applied to all five all right and what is the bad point if anything goes wrong here it would impact all five on the other way around the developer of the cloud environment or cloud uh, so cloud computing environment he may choose to create one instance for every tenant. So if you have 100 tenants, you can have 100 instances. But what is the problem in that? That would make things very complex. Because you would have to apply every upgrade or every break fix into every instances. That is the uh, good point and bad point of uh, multi instances and multi tenanted environment so uh, under the recap I would say multi tenancy is a capacity of any IT resource to support multiple tenants under acceptable isolated conditions or techniques that's it it's very simple so I hope that it's been informative to you and I would like to thank you for leaving have a nice day